robots, no longer something from a sci-fi movie. They are walking, dancing and serving snacks. At this year's CES, one of the world's biggest tech showcases, Chinese firms are dominating the sector with 55% of humanoid robots companies at the U.S. event coming from China. Kate Fisher reports for CNA from CES in Las Vegas. A rat hook to the test. Another one. They're so throwing the ring of pantas. Fighting for dominance in the highly competitive humanoid robot market, these machines are showing off their balance and power to potential buyers. The end goal of uh, developing robots is to have robots uh, work for us to do the dirty, boring jobs for us so that we don't have to do it. And uh, this is our end goal, but uh, for the robots to do that, uh, they have to develop a lot of capabilities. For example, um, in the kickboxing competition, we can see a lot of robots, uh, they do like roundhouse kicks, but they don't tip over. They're going to be balancing on their own. Unitree is just one of 21 Chinese robotics companies showcasing their products at CES more than any other country. From dancing dogs to robotic retailers. All this tech is making me a bit hungry, but I found Galbot who can get me a snack. Let's go for that, please. Oh, okay. And this robot is already working in 70 stores across China in 20 different cities. Those stores are completely autonomous, uh, serving snacks uh, 24 hours a day, seven days a week. And this worker never gets tired or sick. The company, oh, thank you so much. Thank you, Galbot. The company also has robots working in commercial factory floors. Those factories include the likes of Toyota, Hyundai and Bosch. Actually, the advantage of the humanoid and AI large model technology in China is uh, going really fast. It also enjoys uh, actually based on some benefits. One is uh, uh, the manufacturing industry experience in China. And the second is the talent. Our company is based in Beijing, close to Tsinghua and Peking University. And, you know, the talent in uh, Tsinghua and Peking University is the uh, best in China. But the talent isn't confined to China. These robotic ping pong players hail from Singapore, as does this guy. Born and raised on the Singapore floor. Last name and made some time. Image's dexterous robot Tomo is customized for several commercial uses, including making medical devices and packing boxes. It is showcasing the delicate like, fingers and the hand as well as all the architecture that we have built into that, that uh, this, this uh, small unit, right? It is much more than uh, it's handling the secondary packaging. It can also handle as those tiny objects as, sim as small as a, a needle and it, it can be as big as a, 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 a box. So this is designed to, to adapt to any, any solution this technology may be making strides, but sometimes even robots need a rest as we race towards a future that looks more science than fiction. For CNA, I'm Kate Fisher in Las Vegas.